Tonight, a West Omaha family is facing a big bill and a big cleanup, thousands of dollars in damage after a teenage party. It was so wild, the sheriff, police, and state patrol all responded to the scene. This story involves an anxious 911 call and a standoff with police. Brandon Scott has been sorting out all of this for us near 157th in Curtis. We spoke to the homeowners here, and as you can imagine, they didn't want to do an on-camera interview, but they did confirm their son had a party late last night when they weren't home. The father told me it was heartbreaking for him to return and find their house completely trashed. In fact, when I spoke to them, they were trying to clean up the mess. It's, it's really too bad. I mean, I know they're, it's young kids, you know, probably just making a, a bad choice. Carrie McGuire lives just a few doors down from the house where authorities estimate $10,000 worth of damage was done after an underage party got out of control. The neighborhood was quiet this morning, but late last night, as a large group of teenagers partied in this house, a worried dad called 911. I'm actually following my daughter. She snuck out of my house, and I just drove by the house, and there's like 50 kids at this house. And from the messages I've read on my daughter's thing that they were meeting up, they were on Xanax. There could be drinking, but I, I know there's a lot of kids still pulling up in, into this house. Both Douglas County Sheriff's deputies and Omaha police responded to that 911 call. And when they arrived, they estimated there were about 50 kids inside the house at that party. Now, some of those kids scattered as soon as they saw authorities, but others stayed inside the house and hunkered down, refusing to let authorities inside. In fact, they engaged almost in what was a standoff for several hours until a judge ultimately issued an early morning warrant. They yelled obscenities at the deputies that arrived. If you're in an MIP party and you think that you can just tell law enforcement to go away, that that probably isn't going to get them to go away. We, we will get a warrant. We will seek a warrant. And if we get that warrant, we will enter the residence. In the end, 10 kids received citations for being minors in possession, and one was actually taken to jail for refusing to accept the ticket. They were all between 16 and 18 years old, and authorities tell us they're from the Elkhorn, Bennington, and Millard areas. Reporting in West Omaha with photographer Ryan Millsap, I'm Brandon Scott, WWT6 News. The Douglas County Sheriff's Department is still investigating where the teens got their alcohol, but as of now, the parents of the boy who threw the party are not facing any charges. Deputies believe the parents didn't know about the party and didn't condone it.